I was just at a party last night, and it, there was, you know, about 800 people there, and all the men had black suits on. And here I walk in, so there's 18,000 different patterns going on right now, and it's giving any woman who looks at me vertigo. The tie is the key ingredient to wrapping up the entire outfit. Once you look here, you look up, and then you see the magic. You know, some people have them at the first hello, I have them at the wide polyester tie. You take the left and then the right and you cross over and then you put this piece around and you make a shape like that and you glide it through the hole and it flops down. I have over 7,000 polyester ties. Like everything about me, the wider the better. This fabric was taken from my cousin Billy Bovino's couch in Rhode Island. It has a built-in tie clip. You don't get any more show business. And then you gotta pull it a little tight, just a little pulling. Every guy loves a little, just a little pulling. And you go back through the hole. Going through holes twice is always enjoyable, isn't it? And then you take your two fingers, some people like three, but I'll do two because I don't want to scare anybody. I met a wonderful waitress. She gave me this tie. It's a man who's mopping the floor while a woman is in bed reading. The guy has a bead of sweat. A polyester tie that has been stitched of a man mopping the floor. Polyester is a self-cleaning fabric. I have had this tie for 55 years and it looks brand new. Ah, oh, Dolores, Dolores, Dolores. She was my fifth ex-fiance and now she's dating my accountant. Can you believe it? What a handful she was. She didn't need glasses. She drank out of the bottle. A another parting gift from a young lady and it was in a brown paper bag and it said, get well soon. And when I wear it, it's an unpaid endorsement. Dolores, if you're watching this, I have never felt better. Damn it. You don't want to be shiny in showbiz. I just pick it up like this and it's a built-in sweat dabber. Whew. And the shine is gone. Oh, Lord. This one. The soldier here has a big gun coming from his uh, belt area. I'm blushing now. When a young lady gives you a tie with big guns, I think it's a good thing. Right? Is it a good thing? Big guns? Anybody? Yeah, nice crease. Oh. Oh. Showbiz, huh? This is my prized possession. A couple years ago, I uh, hosted this show called the Vava Boom Room. These two bears gave me, the cute little Murray Cub, this wonderful gift. This is a gold-plated polyester tie. What's a cub? Seriously, does anybody know what a cub is? Should I be worried? tie was the first ties I started wearing when I was four years old when I had my first job at the Copacabana as a busboy and you just clipped it on and you clipped it off and it was showbiz. I call this tie the great catch and I eat the spaghetti and the meatballs the meatball will fall down and this tie always caught it. Kids used to call me Murray Meatball when I was a kid but that, that's another story.